Hi, I'm uh, having some trouble taking off in the Mustang from A to A, the civilian version. So, I'm just going to uh, practice going down the top. <laughs> Sorry, we're tired. Practice rolling down the runway at increasing speed to see if I can control it um, slowly. Let's check if the plane is in good condition. Yep. And to keep it simple, we don't have the fuselage tanks on. The left tank and the right tank hang on the same fuel in. It's half a gallon difference. That's, I can't obviously adjust it any better than that. Unless you right click. Nope. Okay, that looks good. Well, I don't want to change it. This is the default, so I don't want to change that. Turn that off. We use, well, it's not cold and dark at the moment. Let's go to cold and dark. And then go to auto start, which should have moved the controls lock, control lock, controls lock and the wheel chocks. I'll need some, whoop, oh, okay. I'm gonna park and break. Okay, we've got a parking brake on. The control locks are off. The flaps. Oh, one minute. I just check out again, my views messed up. Be. Okay, that's not important right now. I'm just trying to get a view of the flaps. Okay, so these are working. Elevator's working. Rotor working. Well, you can see from that it's full deflection. Okay, so. Alright, I'm firstly just going to try and accelerate slowly to see if. I don't mind if the plane goes off the end of the, end of the runway. Uh, I'm just seeing if I can get above 20, 30 knots and keep some kind of control. So, if I can break off, using the differential brakes to keep it kind of straight there. I know I'm supposed to increase this fairly quickly, but I'm doing it smoothly. Okay, now I've got, I've got right, okay, that's not going, okay. All right, uh, I must have done something wrong there, surely, because so suddenly the plane veered to the left, and it was too slow as, I mean, 30 knots. Hold on, okay, I'll be completely mistaken. Let's get this, um, now, let's see. If I'm doing something wrong, I really want to know, because this would be a massive learning point for me in, in taking off in a plane that I've lost complete control of on the wrong way. See, we have a very light wind here. It's, it shouldn't. It's coming in. It's not. <laughs> that's not going to affect us in this. All right, let's try um, a quicker. I don't, I, the manual doesn't actually say what speed I need to put. I've got the stick pull back to lock the wheels. This is fairly smooth. We're going up. Whoa, okay, hold on a minute. Whoa, stop. OK, 
okay. So, I, okay, maybe I should go faster than that. Back, back. He's lurching to. We're not even. We're going. We're not, what speed are we going now? Full, oh, 35 knots. Okay. I have full right brake on. And I know I haven't got the stick pulled back. Let's go put it back again. And okay, let's put the nose down a little bit. Full right rudder. Full right rudder. It's not. I mean. Full right air line. Okay. Right, this time I'm going to go back to the start, and I'm, gonna, I'm not going to throw the throttle forward. But I'm going to push it forward quickly and smoothly, and try and get the nose down on the plane, with the little tail up, before we veer off into the uh, bushes. Because I, I lose differential braking entirely when it goes to 25, 30 knots, so I, I have to rely on the rudder, so I have to get the speed up. Again, if I'm a complete idiot in everything I'm saying and doing here, please tell me. <sighs> okay. Yeah, it's not dead straight, but it's straight enough <laughs> for this test. Manual says 60 to 70. This, this, there's a takeoff area here. Power. So I'm going to get this up as soon as possible. Smoothly. I don't need believe I need to hold the brakes down for this. I will try that next test if this fails. Okay, here we go. Uh, smooth and quick. All the way to. Nose is gone. Okay, foot down. Okay, full rudder, full nothing. Okay, absolute war power now. Let's try the, um, okay. I'll try the, um, hold the brakes down, uh, increase power, and then release the brakes situation. This should auto load. I'm going to resurface the plane, of course. So we start with the default setup. take too long to render this out so I'm just going to let this play in the video it's only a test video okay let's quickly repair the plane which is on pause because it was crash okay so the it should be very destroyed so let's uh, go cold and dark the hangar excellent shape although I just put the master pop up didn't I while I crashed okay but well, this is excellent shape. One cold and dark, which means our locks are on. They're on, see? <laughs> okay, one on the left tank. Haven't used enough fuel to, to, to mess up with this, surely. Okay, auto start. Uh, let's put the parking brake on this time. Hold on, so I'm feeling pedals. Okay, brake on. We're just taking the chocks off, that's fine. Okay. Uh, that's my fault. I guess I must have taken the parking brake off by pressing something. Everything here should be fine for takeoff. I'll correct if I'm correct. Oh, we used one and a half gallons in the left tank. That's Correct that. Okay, this takeoff will be uh, hold, hold, holding the brakes down. Straighten up a little bit. And build up power. The idea being to get the nose down and try and take off. Of course, this way should give me a ridiculous amount of left uh, torque effect. Okay, this, this is kind of panicky. 
I can go. Oh, wait. I was holding the stick back. Let's hold it back all the way this time. Is there some manual? There's not a manual way to set the stick back, is there? See, the tow brakes are working fine here. something this is fairly smooth okay we'll go no whoa slow, slow down slow down slow down no stop okay what speed of which 35 knots 35 knots on um toe brakes okay stick. full back stick full back full back okay. full back brakes aren't working at all here nope plane is just pulling to the left uh, no. here we go crash because i can't obviously stop the plane with no brakes and nothing there you go Okay, for this next and final attempt, I'm just going to try and get off the ground anywhere possible, regardless of safety. I've done this before by just basically gliding across the ground and hoping it didn't hit a fence. Somehow I'm building enough, enough speed up. Okay, one pulls, one pulls it. The hangar says the engine's on. Parking brake on. We'll go cold and dark to check the hangar, which is fine. No, it's damaged now. Okay, it's fine. Complete overhaul. Auto start. Uh, brakes on. Okay, the, the parking brake just to, it turns the wheel shocks off. Okay, so that would mean it's now on. <sighs> it is now. Okay, auto start. Now, I know I'm not warming the engine up, but this is obviously that would not have an effect here in this test. Everything is neutral. Control locks off. Flaps down. Okay, let's get them up. Okay, flaps up. This this time I'm just going to try and get off the ground in any crazy way possible. I'm still going to follow the book. I have the by the book, I believe. I have the stick now pulled full back. You can't see that. You want to see it? I need to see it. It's just that's how far pull back. Obviously, I can't see the screen. Now. Zoom out. Okay, I know this is unrealistic, but uh, we can see what I'm doing here with the stick here. And the pedals, I guess. Can you? Yeah, you can. Okay. <laughs> this is an interesting looking view. Excuse my kind of stressed out situation here. So, uh, parking brake is now off. So we're rolling. Okay. Stick back. Just keep it running, going steady in one way. Here we go. Gradual increase in power. Stick held back. Now, now, it's, now it's losing. Okay, so I'm putting, the, putting it forwards. And see if I can get any kind of speed up to do. Well, I mean, in the last airport, I did this with. So the rudder is on full. It's got everyone's full. To the right. Obviously the tow brakes went over. I've got the st stick back, stick forward, which will nip, which will, which will. I mean, I've got some lift or something. Uh, this, the planes.
please tell me what I'm doing wrong. Because I can't even get the plane going down the one way after 30 knots. And then I can't control it with the stick back, stick forward, any use of the controls. What am I doing wrong? Please tell me. Thanks, I'll quit the recording here. I think I think that's enough to show my incompetence or there's a problem with the plane. Please tell me it's my incompetence. That would be much easier to fix.